Hi, this is Miles at Light Harvest Solar, www.lightharvestsolar.com. I'd like to show you how I built my 12 volt, 750 amp hour absorbed gas mat battery bank that runs our off grid showroom. This bank is made up of 10 75 amp hour batteries run in parallel. When using parallel configuration, it's particularly important to use equal length leads from each and every battery to a common bus bar. That's 10 positive leads to a bus and 10 negative leads to another bus. This is the only way that I would configure a parallel battery bank in order to prevent the uneven charge discharge problems so common with incorrectly wired parallel battery configurations. Using individual equal length leads to a common bus will improve battery performance and longevity. This battery bank is used to power a Xantrex 3000 watt pure sine wave inverter charger with the ability to charge from an outside 120 volt AC source like a generator or a house plug. This is a nice unit but be aware that 3000 watts is just too big for most applications because 3000 watts at 12 volts is 250 amps so it needs a huge battery bank, huge wire, uses up to 8 amps just to power itself and has a good hum when turned on. Not very practical. We also have a nice control panel that tells us battery voltage, amps out, etc. housed in an uninterrupted power supply case on wheels. The output is fused and metered. We've also installed a handy 12 volt cigarette lighter output. The batteries are wired into a junction box through a breaker and into a positive and negative bus bar that is energized with 12 volts DC. Power from the solar panel goes into the bus bar and all the loads like lights come off the bus bar. This is a very easy and convenient way to configure your energy distribution. Thanks for watching and go to www.lightharvestsolar.com for all your solar needs. Have a great day. Bye.